nonsense this week, we're getting straight into it. We're off to Hamburg against St. Pauli, one of the biggest derbies in world football. Can be at 2,000 likes if you're new around here, subscribe because this is going to be absolutely mental. Let's get into it. I'm not going to pretend I don't know where we're going because we do know where we're going this week. One of the biggest games in football. We pumped. Yes, I'm so not sure if you're asking me then. No, I'm asking everyone. Were you excited? Yes. That's good, let's go. Yes, yeah, so today we're off to one of the biggest derbies in world football. It is Hamburg against St. Pauli, and I actually cannot believe we're attending this. This is genuinely a once-in-a-lifetime experience, and I can't wait. It's magnified massively with Hamburg only three points off top, and St. Pauli being two points away from the relegation zone. The magnitude is genuinely unreal. This video is made possible thanks to the amazing people at FotMob. Without them, none of this would be possible at all, and I'm incredibly grateful. The app is also absolutely incredible for anyone who's a football fan. Don't believe me? Read this review of it. Sums it up absolutely perfectly. If you support a team in Germany, if you support a team in Guinea, the app has you covered and it is completely free. Check out at the top of the video description, you will not be disappointed. It is completely free on iOS and Android as I said previously. All you have to do is follow the link at the top of the description, but do it after the video because you know this one's going to be absolutely mental and may just change your life, it's going to be that good. It's not going to change your life, but you will enjoy it for the 15 minutes you watch it for. Right, it's pitch black because it's 4am, um, we're probably both functioning at about 3 hours sleep. We're going to Gatwick, our flight's at 8am, um, and the game is at 1. So, we landed to Germany at 11. So we'll have two hours to get to the game. So any delays would mean we'd miss the game. Are you enjoying the hustle and the bustle at 5am in the morning or whatever? Look at my toothbrush. Right, so see it? Yeah? It's like a lighter. Yeah. <laughs> Why are we doing this here? This isn't... Everything in the airport feels like such a robbery. That was... This and that came to six pound. How much did yours come to? Was your orange juice like 50 quid? That's a bargain. But these experiences we have together are absolutely priceless. They're not. This one's cost nearly 300 quid. I can put a price on that. Welcome to Germany, Ben. We didn't anticipate how cold it would be. No. Why is there a random horse statue just in the. If we're just here, what is that doing there? We've joined a big congregation of Hamburg fans. Um, we don't even know if we're going the right way to where we need to go, but we're, we're having a good time. The pyro's already started, which means we can put that in the title. <laughs> there we are, we're here. That is huge. All aboard the banner bus. We found the St. Pauli fans, um, we're not supposed to be with them though, we're just sort of trying to walk, but we've now ended up, somehow, that's not great security, we could be anyone, and we could be, not that I think I'd want to start a scrap with these many people, but maybe everyone's just really nice outside the stadium, then inside there's rivalries, I don't really know. What I love about the stadium is, like, it's massive, and it's also just in like a forest, well not a forest, there's some trees, uh, <laughs> I don't know if that, I don't know if that quite makes a forest, there's trees around the stadium, essentially what I'm trying to say. He's got a scarf. That's your first scarf this season, nearly. Cool, it does feel nice. I understand people smuggle some big things into these games. I hope I get allowed in with my Colgate Total toothpaste for whole mouth health. Hi Ben, welcome to Hamburg. Well, we're not actually in, we've got to walk up loads of stairs. But the effect is not lost. We've arrived, our journey down here was a round trip of 1,087 miles, which seems, you know, it's quite far, but we flew, remember? We stayed our season total miles travelled up to 15,781. We're in. This is craziness. This game, I just have a feeling about it. We've seen two wins in a row now. This will be three out of three. This will be absolute carnage. This is amazing. This is going to be great. I'm so happy that we do this on the channel. One week non-league, League 2, 
then we'll be here as well. I love it. Come on, it's going to be massive. We've heard that St. Pauli fans are like some of the best in the world, so they're over there. We're not going to start any beef. Good job we're all away up here. Right? Yeah, good job we're all away from them because we would not be able to take on an ant. Although you would, you, you are gargantuan. I don't know what it says. St. Pauli fans are at it already as well. Oi, oi. We missed the moment. Three, two, one. Oh, boys! It's a Hamburg corner and they're celebrating like this. <laughs> All this for a corner. Maybe they've got over 0.5 first corners in the first five minutes. They are loving it. This is madness. This has been an amazing five minutes. Right, so it's eight minutes into the game and the start's been unreal. So the logical thing to do would not be to go and get food. But as I said, we're both functioning on like two and a half hours sleep and we haven't eaten. So naturally, when you're tired, you get hungrier. I'm just always hungry. I need to go find... Oh, God. Oh, no! Oh, we nearly missed it! We are rumbling! Look at my ham and cheese pretzel. Look at your pretzel. Pretzels! St. Pauli are winning. Did not see that coming. How's your pretzel? That's what we call in England. Shit up. They have absolutely shit out it. One thing I've noticed is German football fans must lose so much weight because all they do is jump. They must have incredible calves. Like a farm when there's the baby cows are born. See previous one not subscribing. Yeah, if you if you were considering subscribing, <laughs> doesn't get better. Oh. It's actually 2-0, St. Pauli. I don't know why I've had to emphasize this 2-0 St. Pauli because it wasn't going to be 2-0 no Hamburg, it wasn't going to be 1-0 down. Tor Time. Here's the stats for the day and the season so far. Tickets were 50 quid, travel was 200, foods came to 20 quid and the accommodation was 40 pound for one night, which brings our total for the game up to 310 pound and our total cost for the season up to 4,162 great British pounds spent. Oh Ben, do you know what's releasing within the next 10 days? No I don't, what is releasing the next 10 days? Away days football shirts. <laughs> Away days football shirts, the white and the black. Looking forward to it. Yeah, you don't get one for free. I know, I've already said it. You've got to pay double. Postage and packaging, packaging to Norfolk is double. Seriously, how do they get all these in? I can't get a bottle in, in in England, but they can get these in. It's amazing to look at though. Man, 
die Personen in der Nordtribüne. Bitte unterlass das Abbrennen von This is amazing, they're letting off like a cloud of blue, that's amazing. They're 2 nil down as well. Come on, boys! I honestly don't think Hamburg are going to score. It's all Hamburg, but I just don't see it happening. Like, everything's just missing. I don't know. Probably next to it will be a Hamburg goal at this rate. It's actually 3-0. What has happened? I am so confused. Ben Gibbs, the stadium is flooding out. It is the 66th minute. Talk me through this. Cheers, Ben. I won't, I've on two and a half hours sleep for this. I didn't even realise VAR was in this league. It's been disallowed. All them people walked out. And they were leaving. It's 2 0. Oh, Jeff fans. Where were you on people's shit? Come on. They're not going to win. It's still. It's got to be. Is that in? It's a goal. Come on. 80th minute, but I feel like VAR is going to rule that out, but still. I don't see VAR not ruling that out. But let's for now, let's enjoy it. Oh! Disallowed it. It's been disallowed already. Oh, I don't think they've realised they've disallowed it. Well then. It's been disallowed. <laughs> Nothing can sum this game up more than that. VAR does kill football though, doesn't it? Like what? What's happening with that? Oh no. There's some fires down there in there now. They're put onto the initial flag. I think them fans can be very happy tonight. Huge win for them in the relegation battle, and I think there's no way Hamburg. There's like two minutes left. Um, we could be here for 45 more minutes, and Hamburg still won't score, even though they should have. There's been 16 corners this game. Not that anyone cares. Full time, it is St. Pauli two, Hamburg nil. Ben, you were right about the flares, look. It's been amazing. It's just not the result, but I don't really... We don't have connections to either club, so... St. Pauli fans have been amazing, Hamburg fans have been amazing. From a neutral perspective, what a day. We'll speak in a second before. The Hamburg fans have lost it to their players, by the way. It must be frustrating being the biggest club in the league and just struggling like this. I mean, they're not struggling a second, but they should be romping it. They shouldn't have beat, they should have got promoted last season. Their fans are not happy, look. Don't talk just yet, if you haven't enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like. As I said, can we get 2,000 likes? That was an amazing game, an amazing experience. Unfortunately, the result didn't go Hamburg's way, so the main like scenes were down the other end. end. But the fact that the main scenes were down the other end and we still managed to capture that, that close to us, shows how crazy the German supporters are. What a game, and I can't wait to go to another German game in the future. If you're new around here, subscribe. We're trying to push on towards 100,000 subscribers by the end of this year. 
Uh, we, we I don't know if we're doing another season, but we want to hit it. So please subscribe if you know and there. Be sure to tune in for another away day next week. It's not going to be as big as that one because we have a budget to stick to. See you next week. Um, and it shows how tired we are because he is out for the count. And I have to edit. Go on then.